What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today I have a very special like first impressions. Um, as soon as I saw this, I dropped on his IG. I ran to Lucky Scent uh, and I got a sample guys. Uh, today I'm going to be doing a first impressions of uh, Targi Forest by the house of Rogue Perfumery. And if anybody has never heard of the house uh, Rogue Perfumery, the guy behind it, his name is Manuel Cross. Uh, everything I've tried from him, I absolutely think it's superb quality. Uh, and I actually own a bottle of uh, Mousse Illuminae, which is one of the best oak moss notes in a fragrance I've ever smelled. He's non-IFRA compliant, so that means he can use things like real oak moss and doesn't have to outsource and get uh, use synthetics, guys. Okay, so let's read a little bit more about Targi Forest and then we'll get to doing the first impressions, guys. So, Targi Forest, it's classified as a woody aromatic fragrance. It's unisex. It was released this year, guys, 2023. The fragrance notes are juniper berry, fir balsam, sagebrush, citrus, pine, oak moss, geranium, amber, cedar wood, patchouli, and musk. So, um, I did a little bit of research about Targi Forest, guys. I guess it's a national forest. It spans across uh, three states, uh, and I believe the uh, the states are Utah and Arizona. Um, correct me if I'm wrong, guys, but I believe it's Utah and Arizona, and then there's another one. Uh, I guess it's 2.9 billion acres or million acres, guys. Uh, it's crazy big. Uh, I actually looked it up online. It looks like a pretty cool national forest so anyway guys uh we'll go ahead i had to put this in you know my little sample thing so we're gonna see what this smells like my scent of the day today is paco bonds one million uh parfum guys okay so let's go ahead and get going super excited let this let this air down a little bit give a fair chance uh. mm. okay you can definitely get the signature rogue uh <laughs> oak moss guys uh you've never smelled any of his oak mosses uh it it will come off a little bit uh, like medicinal or just it's, it's just a very different oak moss note than what you get in regular fragrance um but guys it's 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 awesome it's nice oh, man this stuff is like i could pick up the musk i could really pick up the musk guys it's really nice and just soothing it has a soothing quality to it it's, um off my hand here man it's got like this camphorous vibe to it like camphorous vibe almost like a like a vix vapor rub type of mentholated type of feel to it it's very green very musky guys uh the oak moss like i said i could pick it up right away it's kind of like his signature there's a dna to each one of these and uh it has a similar dna uh, I would say, man, though, you could tell the blend on this is, is good. It's good. It's blended. You could tell, guys, when a, when a fragrance is blended well, uh, just how everything works together. They're just so cohesive. Um, but I could say that the two main notes in this right now that are really popping off my skin are the oak moss and the musk very very nice there's some light florals in there uh probably caused by geranium or something like that guys not too sure but just very light florals um this is unisex this is unisex right now um it's kind of giving me vibes of uh monsieur musk by dana but um like a extremely higher quality version of that Okay, I'm starting to pick up some of the woody aspects of this. 
It's nice. It's nice. I, I, let's let's wait like 10, 15 minutes, guys, and uh, I'll come back and update you guys. Uh, so yeah. All right, I'll be back. So guys, I've been sitting here, enjoying the nature, listening to the birds around me while sniffing Targi Forest. And if you read what his inspiration behind this fragrance was, uh, it's just pretty much he wanted to capture an untouched, an untouched forest setting in Targi. Uh, and I think he achieved that here. <clears throat> I will say that this has a very mature, masculine, old school, like 80s vibe going on here. Uh, and it's, it's really smooth, guys. Superb, high quality. Uh, it's really nice. It's really nice, guys. That, that oak moss and musk. And there is a patchouli note that I had picked up while sniffing it uh, for those 10 to 15 minutes that adds an earthiness and is very green. Um, I will say one of the negatives though is I was maybe expecting a little bit more. Uh, I thought that this would be a little bit more unique. Uh, it, it does remind me of fragrances that I have smelled prior, guys. Um, with that being said though, extremely high quality. You could tell that this was made with you know extreme consideration and it's just nice it's just nice i i could say that this is very soothing and relaxing this could be another relaxation uh fragrance for somebody out there who really loves just the smoothness and just the classic it's like a it's like a it, it takes you back in time uh, at least it does for me now obviously it wasn't around in the 80s but it kind of would in my mind, if I would think what the 80s were like back then, it kind of takes me back and transports me into a different time. Really nice, really nice. Now, the 30 mLs go for, I believe, $80 USD, and the 70 mLs go for roughly around $150 USD. So, you know, I always say sample or try before you buy. Just pick up a sample, guys, from Lucky Scent. I think I got the sample for four bucks. Try it out, see if you like it. Um, I think it's really good. I think it's really masculine. Um, it's just, like I said, I, I wish there was just a little bit more going on uh, in this fragrance. But other than that, I think it's a great fragrance so far. So guys, uh, that is my first impressions of Targi Forest by Rogue Perfumery. Uh, thank you so much for watching the channel Lock Sense. I'm your host, Dr. Goo, and I'll catch you in another one. I'll see you later. Stay safe. And remember, you can do anything that you put your mind to. I'm out, guys. See ya.